Hello all and welcome to How to Machines. We are back with a new video on our channel and the topic is recycling of tires. So let's get started with the video. Tires are essential component of vehicles that provide traction support and stability on various road surfaces. They are made from rubber and other materials that are designed to withstand the rigors of driving, including heavy loads, absorbing shocks and maintaining grip in different weather conditions. Tires play a critical role in ensuring safety, performance and fuel efficiency for automobiles. The process of extracting rubber for tire production involves several steps. Rubber used for tire is obtained from the latex saps of rubber trees. Recycling tires into new tires involves a complex process that typically requires specialized equipments and facilities. Used tires are collected from various sources such as tire retailers, automotive shops, or tire disposal centers. The collected tires are then sorted based on their size, type and condition. This sorting process helps determine the appropriate recycling method for each tire. The prepared tires are then fed into shredder which cuts them into small pieces known as tire chips or tire shreds. The shredded material then goes through a granulation process to further reduce the size and produce rubber granules or crumb rubber. The granulation process may involve grinding the tire chips and passing them through the screens to achieve the desired particle size. The rubber granules may undergo decontamination process to remove impurities and contaminants. This can involve washing, rinsing or chemical treatment to ensure the rubber meets quality standards. The rubber granules, which may include devulcanized rubber, are typically mixed with various additives to improve their properties. These additives can include vulcanized agents, reinforcing agents, fillers and other chemicals that enhance the strength, durability and performance of the rubber. The compounded rubber is then molded into desired tire shape using specialized tire building machinery. The molding process involves assembling layers of rubber compounds, fabric reinforcements and steel belts followed by curing or vulcanization. Curing is done under high heat and pressure bond the various components and give tire its final shape and properties. The newly produced tire undergoes rigorous quality control and inspection process to ensure they meet the required standards for safety, performance and durability. This includes tests for thread wear, traction, rolling resistance and other performance parameters. Once the tire pass quality control, they are ready for distribution to tire retailers, automotive manufacturers or other end user for installation and use on vehicles. And with this we reach the end of our video. If you find this video interesting, please like and subscribe to How To Machines and stay tuned for the next video.